Hi everybody, Todd here with Trader on the Street Skills Challenge. Uh, this challenge is called Pounding the Pound and it's very similar to the previous one, the Euro Scalper with the same requirements except we're going to be using the pound dollar to complete this challenge. Again, just as a review, if you didn't do the one last time, it's 20 trades a day, four of the five days in the trading week with a positive expectancy of 0.01 or greater. Uh, now, a couple of requirements for this. Just remember that we've got to do at least 20 trades four of the five days. You can do more. Um, anything that's under five minutes, which uh, is the requirement for this, uh, is going to count towards that expectancy. You want to keep your stop losses uh, pretty quick to get out so that you don't take big losses. Each day, we don't have to have a positive ex expectancy but we do have to have a positive expectancy overall for that week. So you could have a, a negative expectancy on day one, as long as you make it up on day two, three, or four, so that uh, by the end of the week, you've got a positive expectancy. The other thing is that's uh, really critical, like I mentioned, is they've got to be under five minutes in length. If they're over five minutes in length, it won't count for this. So um, pound dollar, five-minute trades help us to understand how to get in and get out of trades quickly so that we don't um, let them go for a long period of time. Uh, we want to focus on making sure that we've got good setups, that we can expect to get in and get out fairly quickly. And uh, for the five days, we want to have uh, those 20 trades minimum, and we want to make sure that at the end of the week, we have at least an expectancy greater than 0.01. .01. If you can do that, you'll pass the challenge, and you'll learn how to become a better scalper.